this is a quick video on how to manipulate a two dart bodice block into a waist dart using the pivotal technique. We would need a two dart bodice block that fits you, a dress form or your client, paper scissors, ruler, pencil and eraser, a pattern notcher, an all punch which is optional, tape measure, and a pattern paper or tracing paper. Place the block on top of the pattern paper. This shoulder dart will be eliminated and gets absorbed by the waist dart. To start the pivotal technique of dart manipulation, Choose the leg closest to the high point shoulder. We trace around the perimeter of the block down to the neck and center front until we reach the first leg of the waist dart. With an awl, which is optional, here I'm using a pencil placed at the bust point and without lifting, I slowly rotate the block to close the second leg of the shoulder dart. I just continue tracing from the starting point to the shoulder tip, down the armhole, to the side until I reach the second dart leg of the waist dart. Darken the bust point and the vanishing point of the waist dart. Draw the new dart legs until the vanishing point, making sure that both legs are of the same length. You can just use a ruler or a tape measure for this, but it is at this point where an adjustment might be required. Here I had to redraw the waist and blend it to the side. Also had to erase all old markings so I won't get confused. For the chevron shaping of the waist dart, score one leg and take it to the second leg. Here I have the block towards the center front and with paper scissors just cut it along the perimeter of the waist. I have now manipulated the two dart bodice block into the waist dart. Here I just need to notch the dart legs and the armhole. If you find this video helpful, let me know by liking this video and subscribing to my channel. Thank you for watching!